What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my channel if this is your first time here. Um, I am Morgan Alexis. So basically today's video is just how I moisturize my locks. What my moisturize lock routine is and things that I do to make sure that my locks stay healthy. So let's go. So the first thing is make sure that you are sleeping with a satin bonnet. If you don't have a satin bonnet, make sure it's a satin pillow. And if you got the coin coin, go ahead and get the silk. Oftentimes though, my bonnet has life in the middle of the night and like jumps off my head. There's really nothing I could do about it, but I try my best and that is enough. Okay. Okay. The next thing is I either two options here. So one I do if I take a shower like in the morning um, I will go in the shower and I will wet my hair a little bit So like I'll just use the water that's on my hand and just make sure I kind of like go throughout my locks and wet it And also the steam from your shower if you do bathe in a hundred degree water like I do the steam also provides really good moisture for your hair. If I'm not taking a shower in the morning because I took one at night, then I will just kind of do the same thing, but at the sink, and then I will go in with my moisture mist. So basically using something that is water-based, but also provides moisture in the hair. Um, you could also just use an oil that you are comfortable using and then making sure that the order that you go in is using water first and then oil to seal the moisture, which is the water. Not the other way around because oil doesn't provide moisture, the water does. So this is the oil that I would use if I don't use my moisture mist, which is the growth oil for locks by Natural Kinks, all Natural Kinks, excuse me. Um, and so I could I would use this especially on my edges after I'm at the sink and just finished rubbing my hair my hands through my hair I will go in and Kind of like use this throughout my hair more so focusing on my scalp because I prefer not to put oil on the body of my locks Unless it's in a mixture like the moisture mist but after I finish spraying my hair down and making sure that it feels good it feels damp um, I make sure that I air it out I don't really try I try not to put it up until I feel like it's kind of dried um, because if you know me I'm a little scared of mold and I know it's not that easy to get mold but I just want to be cautious the next thing um, that I make sure to do is just drink yo water I got that water I got that water. I got that. And if you don't, if you're not drinking your water, even better, eat your water. Eat your fruits, okay? Papaya is a really great fruit. It is 90% water. Uh, it tastes good. Make sure that internally you are also providing your hair an option to thrive, honey, okay? And so that is it i really like to keep it simple keep it basic there's no long drawn out process that i do for my locks because i know when i listen to my hair it says less is more my moisture routine usually is like just when i feel like my hair needs it but mm, we'll say every three days but the water and the fruit and the satin bonnet that's every single day Really, the basis of it is just protecting your hair at night, making sure that you provide the moisture it needs throughout the day. I know when I was a loose natural, I would use the lock method. So a liquid oil and a cream. We just kind of take out the cream part when you have locks, because we don't want to build up. Really and truthfully, it's kind of the same, same thing, right? I hope this video was helpful. Um, and I hope it provided you some tips on how to keep your locks moisture rise or just your loose natural hair 
stay tuned for the next video i am trying to do an upload routine of every monday and friday so let me know if that's a schedule that y'all like and if not i might switch it up um but i'm really trying my best to stick to that so this it <laughs> i know this video is really short but i hope you guys liked it i appreciate you all for watching and make sure you guys click the subscribe button um also put the notification bell on that really lets youtube know that you're feeling my videos and it just helps me and it helps support me um you know with the coin coin and i appreciate you all for supporting me thus far and so let's go i appreciate you all thank you for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video peace